Hello Taurus, and thank you guys so much for tuning in to my channel. Please keep in mind that my readings are general and may or may not resonate, so take what does and leave the rest. Also, please be sure to check your sun, moon, rising, as well as your Venus signs for more insight, and don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, you guys. If you guys would like to book a personal with me, ask me a question, or just check out my horoscope page, everything that you need will be down in the comment section below. Okay, you guys, it says pay attention to the red flags, the signs of cautioning you. And release your ex. The time has come to clear your energy. All right. I feel like you try to give this relationship a chance. You love this person. But I feel like you're ignoring some red flags here. Maybe the fact that it's time to release this person. Maybe you keep trying to work on something that's just not working anymore, okay? You may be holding on to somebody a bit too much here. Too tight. Yeah, Ten of Wands. It's become a burden for you. I feel like it's time that you move on, but you're stressed about it. You're afraid to let your emotions go for this person because I feel like this person has been a stable person in your life for some time. But now at this point, it's, it's stagnant. All right, and you're just stuck in your head thinking about past moments when this person was good to you, and I don't feel like they have been lately. You've been feeling really alone, like this person is detaching from you, they've been acting very cold and distant as well. Okay, Taurus, so let's see what's going on with your person. Spirit, what is going on with this person that Taurus is thinking of? What is going on with this person that Taurus is thinking of, Spirit? What is going on with this Taurus and the person that they're thinking of? Okay, could be a Gemini, but the lovers is showing up. I feel like there's an energy of you needing to make a choice here. Whether or whether you should uh, keep investing in this person, this relationship, I feel like it causes you a lot of sadness. This person is very sad too. I feel like they're also at a crossroads. Both of you guys are in the same energy here. And with the four of wands, I see this person still wanting to grow the situation with you, but yet feeling like they don't have any way to do it. This person feels like they're in this alone, or maybe they just don't feel like they have what it takes to be with you. Yeah, they keep thinking about the past memories too. That's the only thing that's still connecting you guys is the past, what you guys used to be like. But I feel like y'all are ignoring the fact that there is not... Um, the same energy being presented as it was when you guys first met. There, That spark is no longer there. And I feel like that's what makes you guys so sad because it's like, damn, this could have been my person. And it very well could have been. But, you know, maybe that was the person that aligned with you before you became the person that you are now. Okay? Okay, so let's see what the possible outcome is for you and this person, Taurus. What is the outcome for Taurus and this person? What is the possible outcome for Taurus as it pertains to this person, Spirit? What is the outcome as it pertains to Taurus and this person? Okay, we have the King of Pentacles here. The Queen of Swords and the world. I see you guys leaving each other alone. Finally, there's something new that comes into you. But I feel like this person remains cold and hard. Yeah, Ten of Swords at the bottom of the deck. The situation is definitely coming to an end. Whether you want it to or not, I see you needing to focus on your money and get your power back. Let's see what your advice is from Spirit. The High Priestess, you need to go with your intuition more. There is some heartbreak in the situation, but I feel like this heartbreak should, should make you more independent. It should make you look at people a bit differently. Um, yeah, with the Justice card, I feel like you need to learn how to be more fair to yourself. When you notice that people aren't giving you what you deserve, cut them the fuck off and out. Okay, so let's see. Let's get a card from the Rebel deck. from the rebel deck spirit it says you tight ass loosen the fuck up control freaks don't get lead so i feel like this is you closing yourself off to the world because you still want this person but spirit is telling you it's time for you to open up you don't need to keep um trying to fight for a relationship you need to start looking for a new one all right thank you 